Well, since the CFC made the jump to professional soccer this season, the team's marketing department wanted to do a documentary on its inaugural pro campaign. And who knew it? It would also feature a global pandemic. The docu-series is called No Matter What, The Rise of Chattanooga FC. It's scheduled to air early next year. News 12's Rick Nyman gives us a sneak peek. When you go out tonight, you're going to play against somebody. They don't want to just beat you, by the way. They want to embarrass you. We've all watched the documentaries, you know, on, on, uh, on TV and, and uh, you know, wondered what it would be like. And, and uh, it was actually pretty cool. Uh, my wife's not even a sports fan, and she loves these sports docs because they're like soap operas. They're drama. There's, you know, there's all the personal stories. It starts with the open tryouts even before the first match. Um, there's some great storylines that came out of the first tryouts. There's some players that played some significant minutes that were the first time that Peter and Bill got to watch them play was in the open tryout. Uh, Alec Reddington, who started in goal you know, almost all season for us, uh, came out of that open tryout. So before it was... A, a compelling story of the of a team's first pro season, right? Uh, an established team that's got roots in the community. And then now you add in like the drama of COVID, pandemic shutdown, um, what's going to happen, the economic threat of no fans in the stands and all those kinds of things that you can now layer into the story. We had a game in July that we put on TV here locally, one of the first ones we came back. I was out for two games because I had a fever that, that wasn't COVID, but I couldn't be around the players. I had to get tested like seven times to make sure that, you know, I didn't have COVID and uh, ended up producing a TV game from my bed uh, while, <laughs> while that was all going on. We're all here now for a reason. Where and when will people be able to view it? Uh, it will be out in um, this winter, so probably late January, early February. We have over 600 hours of footage that we're going through right now in edit, and uh, you know, so there's a lot to, to wade through, and that's why it's going to be February before this comes out. This is as close knit a team as I've probably ever coached. Certainly, at, been a part of at the pro level for sure. I hope that that comes out, and I hope that people see how much of a, a real family this group became. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in congratulating Chattanooga FC as the champions of the 2020 NISA Eastern Conference. Our guys just really, really enjoy each other. When you see them on the bus, when you see them in the meeting room, there's a lot of laughing, there's a lot of cutting up, there's a, they, they keep it really loose. Um, that, that will definitely come out. You'll definitely see some of that. You'll probably see Peter singing a little bit. That looks fantastic. At least the producers drew the line at Rick Nyman singing in that documentary. The CFC plans to air that show locally before putting it on a streaming service.